I'll squeeze it like that and look for water between my fingers or a drop coming out the bottom and that shows me I've got 50% moisture. If it's dripping, I'm over 50% over that can cause my pile to go anaerobic uh, which means I'm losing oxygen and if you're losing oxygen then the beneficial bacteria and microorganisms are going to start dying off and the non-beneficial microorganisms are going to start breeding which are not going to be good for your plants in the long run if you were to use this compost. Uh, to be certified organic it has to be turned five times within 15 days uh, and have a temperature above 131 degrees maintained for those 15 days. I I'm turning it then at 160. Other times I might turn it is if I'm squeezing it and I've got too much moisture in there then I need to get some other dry material in there, turn it, get some oxygen in uh, and dry material to soak up the moisture so that I'm back to a level of 50% hopefully. And I'll check my temperature kind of at different levels in the pile because there may be colder hot spots. And I'll take three or four temperatures at a time and average them out just to get my temperature. I want to have enough high nitrogen to make the pile heat up to 160 degrees so that kills pathogens and weed seeds. Once it gets to 160 degrees then I want to turn it because at a certain point it gets too hot and then it can become anaerobic that way. Uh, it also can combust and start on fire. <laughs>